Hello everyone, my name's Nancy. I'm one of the front of house assistants at the Lawrence Batley Theatre. Maybe you've seen me there. Well, I'd like to share with you a story today. One of my favourite stories that my dad used to read to me when I was a little girl. And it's called From a Railway Carriage by Robert Louis Stevenson. It's more of a poem than a story. But I like this particular version because of the beautiful illustrations by the artist Llewellyn Thomas. So let's begin. Are you ready? I'm going to start the story on a page. It doesn't have any words, but it shows the start of the journey at the railway station. The little girl waving goodbye to her parents. Faster than fairies, faster than witches. Bridges and houses and hedges and ditches. And charging along like troops in a battle. All through the meadows, the horses and cattle. Mm -hmm. All of the sights of the hill and the plain fly as thick as driving rain. And ever again, in the wink of an eye, painted stations whistle by. And here is a child who clambers and scrambles all by himself and gathering brambles. Here is a tramp who stands and gazes. And there is the green for stringing the daisies. And that's what those children are doing, Nandy. Here is a cart. Oh, run away in the road, lumping along with man and load. And here is a mill. And there is a river. Each a glimpse and gone forever. And then at the back of the book, on the final page, is where the story ends and the journey ends. Look at the seaside. But it's night time, so it must have taken a long time for the little girl to reach the seaside. Oh, what fun she's going to have there, eh? Well, I hope you enjoyed that story and I hope to see you again sometime. Bye for now. Bye.